Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel and of course 21H2 for Windows 10 is now available. Don't mix that up with 21H2 Windows 11. It's a separate thing. Windows 11 is Windows 11. 21H2 simply tells you in what time of the year was released the update first half or second half. So Windows 10 also is 21H2 now and it is available for seekers but some of you might not actually see it and if you don't see it how do you get it well you can go in the download page for windows 10 it is available i will share the link here and here it is they updated the page today to windows 10 november 2021 update that's 21 h2 so the windows 10 november 2021 update is available for download it is uh, something that now you can download a media creation tool. You can download an image that you can put on a USB thumb drive. You can, of course, do clean installs with it. If you don't see it in your Windows update, you really absolutely want it now. That is the way you're going to get it right now. It's a small update. It's a cumulative update. And it doesn't contain much. Um, like I was saying on uh, my previous video, if you don't see it, just wait for it. It doesn't matter. It contains so little changes that it doesn't really matter if you have it or not right now. Who might be interested in getting it now could be version 2004 users. If you're on 2004, you haven't been offered any Windows updates for a future update. Well, maybe that's the time now to do it because next month is your last Patch Tuesday security update. After that, you'll be on your own. So if you don't see it, what you could do, and I would actually do that personally, is go here and update through the Windows Update uh, page um, here that I will share on the description below. But for most people, there's just like so little changes in there that nobody will see anything. Don't expect to have Windows 10 show up and look like Windows 11. This is not at all what this is. This is a very small kind of service pack style update. And we'll talk about the features. I already talked about them, but we'll talk a little more in details of the features that are offered in this new update. So if you want to download it right now or have an image for future installs, uh, they updated the media creation tool and the download page. I'm going to sh share, I'm going to share this page with you guys and uh, hope that you enjoy. If you do, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.